the Apple WWDC 2024 conference has been announced for June 10th, shortly after a developer and then a public beta of watchOS 11 will become available. In this video, I walk you through the steps uh, to install the software. At the time of recording this video, uh, we don't yet know what features watchOS 11 will bring. That will become clear on June 10th, but the previous version represented a significant upgrade. Some, like Bloomberg's Mark Gurman, believe this will be a minor update. He thinks Apple would, will dedicate more time this year to upgrading its hardware. Regardless, we are expecting uh, some new goodies. This may include a revamp of fitness and health metrics, more robust sleep tracking, new watch faces and more. Apple has also announced that rich communication services messaging support will be available uh, sometime this year. Also, we expect AI to permeate throughout the entire Apple ecosystem. The company has reportedly struck a deal with ChatGTP. So let's move to the topic of the day, how to install watchOS 11 public beta. To start off, users must first upgrade their iPhone to the public beta version of iOS 18. This is a required step because the watchOS 11 works in tandem with the most recent iOS version. In order to do this, you must sign up uh, on Apple's beta software website. Once registered and the new version of iOS 18 is installed, the watchOS 11 public beta option becomes available. You can find it under General Software Update in the Watch app on the iPhone. Users can then select this option to download and install the beta version to their watch. To access the watchOS 11 beta, you'll need an Apple ID. Uh, you probably have one already, so just use those, uh, that username and password to sign in. Optionally, you can also enroll in the Apple de Development Program, uh, but you don't really need to do this, uh, and you can bypass this step uh, to avoid the enrollment fee. A developer Registration to the developer program does offer one benefit. It gives you a head start as public betas typically come out uh, a month earlier to those uh, that are on this program. On the screen, you can see the dev devices that we expect to be compatible with watchOS 11. They include pretty much everything since uh, Apple Watch Series 5. As a reminder, installing early software versions carries risk like uh, bugs and other problems. And Apple, of course, encourages you to report any issues you come across. The other option is to wait for the public release of the software, which should occur uh, probably in September. 